officially starting off on the Camino Francis. And I think I concerned a few people by uh, <laughs> leaving town at 3 p.m., going up into the mountains with no room reserved. But uh plan is just to camp somewhere in the Pyrenees. Should be just fine. And also avoiding the crowds of people that will be leaving St. John Pier de Poor in the morning. The Pyrenees have been really great. I hope <laughs> the rest of the trail is as nice. I doubt it's going to be. In fact, I know it's not gonna be as scenic, but uh, yeah, I'm enjoying it. I'm the only person up here. I've not seen a single other pilgrim since leaving town, which is just incredible. <laughs> I know that's not gonna last for long, but uh, yeah, afternoon start for the win. Well, here we are at the French-Spanish border, officially in Spain for the rest of the Camino. It's really just so wild 
that I've hiked 10 miles and have not seen one other pilgrim. <laughs> and I probably won't tomorrow until I catch up with the, uh, the folks that left this morning. Possibly one of the few easy nights of camping along the Camino. But we'll see. I'll camp when I can, but certainly not expecting to a whole lot. It is another gorgeous morning in the Pyrenees. Have it all to myself again. Crazy. I'm liking it. <laughs> I still can't believe this start that I'm having. It's so different from what everyone else experiences, which is just a big, massive pilgrims leaving from town uh, early in the morning. I left in the afternoon, literally have not seen a single other pilgrim yesterday or today since leaving town camped in the Pyrenees. It's beautiful up here. So yeah, no matter how crowded the rest of the trail gets, uh, this was a very, very nice start. Mm -hmm. 